So welcome back friends. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today I wanna to share with you something that I think is really special and that is designing on a budget. Now, have you ever been thumbing through a catalog like Pottery Barn and you see these beautiful furnishings and accessories and then you look at the price tag and you get that sticker shock where it's like, oh, I love that, but I would never pay that much money for a piece of furniture. Well, today I wanna to share with you how we achieved a Pottery Barn look for less. So the first thing that I wanna start with are our sofas. Now, we purchased these sofas from Bob's Discount Furniture, which I think if you've never experienced Bob's Discount Furniture, it's something to definitely check out if you have one in your area. Don't let the word discount discourage you. Uh, this furniture is very well made and very affordable. So our sofas are the Katie sofa, and we got them in the light linen color. They were $399 each. Now I'm going to insert a photograph of a similar sofa, the slip covered sofa from Pottery Barn, that is $1,000 and up. Now the one that we got is the 80 inch sofa. It does come in a love seat style and it also comes in a 90 inch. But we got the 80 inch and we got two of them. And as you can see, there's a lot of really close similarities in the style. Now ours are not slip covered, so we won't be removing the material so that it can be laundered, but it definitely has that slip covered look. And if you are familiar with Pottery Barn at all, you know that their furniture and accessories is geared 100% towards natural earth tones, classic timeless pieces. And those are the type of pieces that you want to invest in. It's much easier to change out a wall color or a rug or your flooring uh, than it is to go and replace your whole room full of furniture. So a good point is if you love the color red, buying a red sofa is probably not a safe bet because a red sofa is going to be much more difficult to transition into a new decor style if you choose to. So sticking with those neutral colors, those linens, the earth tones, those are really gonna be where you're gonna be able to save money and also be able to transition your decor very, very, very easily to fit your furniture and your style. So the next thing that I wanna share with you are our lamps. Now I will insert a photograph of a Pottery Barn lamp. Although the base does not look the same, the drum shade is very similar. And Pottery Barn is known for using these large drum shades on their lamps. So ours has this large drum shade, and then it has this sphere look at the bottom that is really unique. It adds a lot of visual interest. It's in this oil rubbed bronze color, and so it stays in that earthy neutral tone. So our lamps were around $39 and the Pottery Barn lamps, as you can see, are substantially more. So again, these are really heavy, weighty, good quality lamps that we purchased. They're timeless. They're going to carry us through many, many, many years. And we saved a lot of money by going outside to a furniture store that really geared us more towards being budget friendly and quality versus just sticking by the name. Another thing that Pottery Barn is known for is using a lot of really deep, rich wood tones. So this coffee table is not similar to ours, but the color very much mirrors that of what Pottery Barn really represents. And so we chose these beautiful apothecary style coffee table and end table set. And the thing I love about the end table is that it has, instead of a drawer, a platform that you can pull out that allows you to have extra uh, surface space to set a beverage or a magazine or a book. And I love that feature of this table. 
Another thing that we picked out that was really unique and Pottery Barn is known for throwing in some of those pieces that are really um, conversation starters. And one of those things is this chair called Timeless. It is a recliner and it has these clocks on it and it just has a unique pattern and it's fun and interesting. And like I said, it's a great conversation starter and it's really comfortable. And then lastly, I wanna talk about Pottery Barn accessories. So Pottery Barn is known for their flat top pillar candle, the uh, flameless candle. And I've shared this with you guys in my flameless candle video, but these candles are beautiful. We got them from Amazon. We got a trio. Um, they were like less than $30 and we got all three. And if you purchase something like this from Pottery Barn, you're looking at anywhere from $18, probably upwards to, you know, $40 or $50 for a flameless candle that's a flat top pillar. So I hope this video gives you a little bit of insight into how you can have a beautiful home furnished at, just like you went to Pottery Barn and shopped and picked out those beautiful pieces that are signature staples from Pottery Barn without having to spend the Pottery Barn prices. Now, I love Pottery Barn. They're known for their quality, but I do believe that you can get similar quality, just as good, and you can get items that really mimic that look. When people visit our home, they say, this looks like a Pottery Barn showroom in here. And I love that because that was the look that we were going for. And I think that we really achieved that look in our furnishings and being very selective in our color tones and really trying to find things that fit not only our style, but also the style of Pottery Barn. So I hope you've enjoyed these tips and maybe perhaps if you're thinking of refurnishing your home, you can visit a store like a Bob's Discount Furniture or somewhere where you can really find that same style Style that Pottery Barn offers without having to pay the Pottery Barn prices. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful week. If you haven't done so, subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you here as part of the At Home with Zane family. Check out my video description for links to all my social media sites, my Instagram, my Pinterest, my Facebook. It's all on there. It's a one-stop shop. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll look for you the next time.